good morning. Today is Tuesday, March 10th, 2020. And today I just wanted to give you all a brief description of what this channel is. It is my name, but it is also a channel for our family, just documenting what we do because um, our kids grew up fast, like they're in their tween years, I guess, if you want to call it, tween, tween, teens, we have a teenager now, but we didn't do a whole lot of filming or, you know, we didn't have a camera, or we did have a camera and I just wasn't consistent with taking video when they were younger, so I'm going to do um, as much as I can now before they get um, too old and out of the house and it'd just be great to look back on what we did and since you know time goes by fast you will see a lot of family stuff you also see some some work stuff like um, career minded things um, trying to be like uplifting and and encouraging to everybody I am uh, an entrepreneur, a business owner. It was a dream of mine for years to do that. So it's going to be documenting that as well. Um, I'm not sure. I do video editing, so I'm not sure if I'm going to um, do a whole lot of tutorial stuff. I mean, there's a lot of that stuff already on, on YouTube. So um, I might just let that you know, for somebody else that's better at explaining that kind of stuff. But yeah, we hope you follow along. Uh, I do have something I want to talk about today. And it's uh, something that I have been struggling with for a long time, probably since high school. Well, I mean, my entire life. I'm sure everybody struggles with it. But that is getting out of your comfort zone. I just found a book on it that I'm reading I'm about halfway through and it is it's pretty good so far um, so that's what I want to talk about today comfort zone okay so comfort zones we all have our comfort zones right like we all thrive in certain situations like for some people they like to be the center of attention or the life of the party other people tend to want to you know, just hang by the wall, uh, be a wallflower, um, and just kind of observe what's going on. There's no good or bad or right or wrong way to any of that. What I can say is, as an introvert, I tend to avoid situations like uh, big groups of people, and um, it, it kind of terrifies me because I get this thinking going in my head like, you know, what are they going to think of me? Am I going to say something dumb? Am I going to look like a fool? Well, maybe look like a fool, but... So it's something that I want to overcome, and maybe you want to overcome it too. Or maybe it's uh, something else that you're avoiding that's, that's not in your comfort zone. Whatever it is, let's all grow together. Let's all tackle this together, and, you know, we'll get through it. And, you know, you don't have to change who you are. Um, but just realize that you may be missing a lot of opportunities by um, not getting out of your comfort zone and not rising to the challenge as this, this book uh, called Reach that I'm reading. You know, it's about getting out of your comfort zone, rising to the challenge and building confidence. And I highly recommend it. I'm not all the way done with it yet. But so far, it's been it's been pretty good. Another thing that I'm doing to get out of my comfort zone is these vlogs. Uh, it's uncomfortable to talk to a camera lens and also talk to a camera lens while people are watching you. So I am here in the Aldi parking lot and I'm about to get some groceries and 
if you've ever been to an Aldi store, it can be kind of crazy. So it's me in Aldi. Can you see it? <laughs> My word, that place was a zoo. Man, I'm glad that's over with. So for me, one of the big things is networking events. You know, being a business owner, you have to get out and meet people and promote yourself and yeah, talk about yourself. Like, that's not me at all. I don't like, I don't like talking about myself. Um, I like to just, you know, I don't want to come across as somebody that's full of themselves. So I think there's like a fine line in that area when you when you talk about and promote yourself. But I do know that it's important and it's important to the success of our business and our livelihood to do that. Yeah, it's just something that I'm not, that I don't enjoy doing, but it's something that um, I'm gonna have to learn to do it and and to be successful at it you got to keep doing it Kitten, are you watching YouTube? Yes. Yeah. You want to be a YouTuber? Yeah. What do you want to tell yourself in 5 years when you're 13? What do you want to say to yourself? I don't know. You want to say, hi Sophie of the future. That I don't want to go to school. Why? Because it's lame. So I hope everybody had a good day today. I had a great day. I'm learning a lot every day. Growing a lot every day. And, you know, keep striving to, to reach past your comfort zone and to push yourself and to grow and you know to see where it takes you so until the next video i'll catch you later